light will start zipping back and forth at a faster speed. Each player wants to score on their respective opponent's side. So this side needs to score by stopping on this green light. And respectively, this side needs to score by stopping on this green light. So, I was just setting up the resistors and everything. And I only, I only did three and it's already a mess. How am I gonna do the rest? Like, is there gonna be no space? Alright, so it took a while, but now I know all of them work. And this looks like a bomb. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's just a mess. There's so many wires everywhere. I wasn't expecting this. I know this is really inefficient, but I used if statements to see which one should be on, and that is controlled by this variable. So basically, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add to this variable, and then the if statements are gonna decide which one to turn on. So basically, this means if I'm if I want to go from this green one to this green one, I'm gonna be adding one to that variable every let's say second. And if I want to go back from this one to this one, I'm gonna be taking away from it. If that makes sense. A quick example. I'm gonna be adding to it. So that means every 100 milliseconds it's going to add and it's going to check so if i if i reload this there so now it's going back and forth and now all we have to do is add the buttons Okay, so uh, we have a bit of a problem. So I did it. I did everything. So if you get it, it makes a sound, right? But if you do it on this side, it gets stuck. But they have the same exact code. How the hell is this happening? So I fixed it and now you can do that side and this side. 